let me check my apps. Let me launch your app. I'm not even using notes. Why is it running in my background? I'm gonna just slide to quit that. I don't. I'm not even using phone. Slide to quit that. I hardly ever use Safari. How the hell did it get open? Slide to quit that. I use YouTube now and again, but I'll get it out of my background. Uh, furthermore, I'll just kill all the damn apps in the background. Hey YouTube Opinionated Review here, bringing you guys a video on Simplexity. It's by Frozen Sun and the Tinder Big Boss repo for $2.99. Now basically what Simplexity is, it's a new way of multitasking. So I'm going to double click my home button and instead of my multitasking tray or my app switcher opening up at the bottom, it brings down this little sexy UI that you see right here. Now these are all my apps that I have running in the background. Also, if you swipe left, you're going to see over to the right that you have an extra panel. Now, at this moment, there's a little box, so I normally have to swipe, move it up and move it down to reveal everything. So, hopefully, he fixed that bug in the near future. Probably, it's just my device. But, these are actually plugins for your app switcher. It goes hand in hand with switcher loader. I'll show you guys that. I also did a video on switcher loader. But these are actually with switcher loader installed. These are the plugins that I have. I would have in my multitasking tray. So I watch. I see my dock apps right there. I have my now play. And I can go ahead and play a song. I can go ahead and change the volume of that song. Pause that song. Visit my iPod. Lock my rotation. Adjust my brightness. And also kill all the apps if I want to. Now I'm going to swipe back over to the left. And these, as I said, these are my apps. If I wanted to quit one of these apps, I could touch on the icon, just like a notification, touch, and then slide to quit. Just like that. It's so nice and smooth. And if I wanted to open an app, like I'm going to open my settings app, all I have to do is touch the icon, and boom, bingo, it opens up the app that you selected. Now, there's a tab inside setting. You just scroll down until you see Simplexity right there, and you tap on it. And here you can customize the tweak up. A bit more to your liking now you can enable and disable it and I'm gonna click customize the layout as you see my layout just now it was red the window layout was red so I'm gonna go ahead and just tinker around with it a bit I don't know and just pull it up and you guys will see that's the window right there that's why I didn't change I don't really like that that window so normally I just leave it blank so it's just gonna be no color as you see now let me go ahead and check the table view the table view is the little this I think that's the table view right here let's go ahead and adjust that a bit and ah double tap the home button and you can see it all the table view also changed now I have Zephyr installed that's why I'm getting all confused there but you can go ahead and play around with these settings in here you can also blur out the background like the, the window you can change the border color you can also change the rounded corners, you can change the label color, and also the inactive labels. So at the beginning of the video you saw I had some blue labels, those were the inactive apps that were running in my background, or were in my background, and I just closed them out. Now we're going to go over, <clears throat> go back out, and you see the kill plugin, now these, you can go ahead and change the settings for the background color, these are your, the kill, this is the kill app plugin, so let me go ahead and just change, change it very quickly so you can see what I'm talking about change it to blue and then I'm gonna double tap let's pull over and push up and you can see now the kill app plugin is blue so you can go ahead and play around with all those this is the Wi-Fi plugin I have that one disabled as I told you before it goes hand in hand with switcher loader so I'm gonna go into switcher loader and these are the plugins right here that I have when I double tap and I swipe to the left these are all the plugins that I have right there that switcher loader. Check out my video on that. So these are them. I have the Wi-Fi one disabled. It shows your Wi-Fi IP address or probably a 3G IP address. You can also enable it just by dragging it in here and you can arrange them however you want it to be laid out inside the, the little panel that's right there. <clears throat> but that's basically it guys. You, Keep in mind that it takes over your multitasking tray, so if you're using 
Zephyr and you swipe from the bottom on your home screen, it's not going to show your multitasking tree. It's going to show this tweak that uh, simplexity. So keep that in mind. It's not going to show Zephyr because it completely takes over your multitasking tree. You do not have your multitasking tree no more. Every time you double tap the home button, this is going to be your multitasking. But yeah, I hope you can fix that little bug. This one is called Simplexity. It's in the Big Moss repo for $2.99. It's a matter of preference if you want to check it out or not. With that being said, please rate, comment, subscribe. Have a nice day.